Welcome to the Dave Show. My name is Dave, and today I'm here to put together the sofa bed as you see here in this photo. Now, it does come in these two big, gigantic boxes that are very heavy, so be careful with it. And the company did send me this product for review, but they wanted me to show you uh, what it is, what comes with the package, kind of how to put it together, and what it looks like. So I'm going to get all this stuff out of the box, and we're going to look at all the pieces and parts and figure out how to put this together, and I'll show you what it looks like. So let's dig in. Okay, I got everything out of the box, and actually it looks like it's fairly simple. Now, my package did not have any instructions on how to assemble this, so I did reach out to the uh, vendor. They did send me a PDF file of the instructions, and they said the instructions are supposed to come in with it, so when you get your package, you should have your instructions. Uh, but if not, and you're watching this video, I'm here to tell you it looks like it's fairly simple to do. There's no um, parts as such. There's nothing to put together. The instructions they sent me showed about putting some wheels on, but um, this already had wheels on it. So I really don't have anything to do. Each piece comes like this. I'll show you more details of it. But um, it's really easy because it has these little metal V-shaped things um, on these little parts and, and on the couch itself it has the same v-shaped things and you're supposed to just be able to slide them right in now this here is for the small piece they have a back for the back piece and so forth and then there's a pull out now, i'm going to bring you in and show you more details of that as well um, but i just want to let you know about the instructions and it looks like it's fairly simple to do now what's cool is this has um, as you saw in the pictures and i'll show it again here it has a a long section and then a couch section. Now you can put the long section, kind of like the recliner kind of thing, something you're gonna chill in. You can put that on the left side or you can put it on the right side, or right side, or left side. You can put it on either side that you want, which is really cool. So you can kind of design it <laughs> as you want. It's all com completely convertible, um, which is nice. And then um, I'm gonna probably put it this way, I think we decided to put the long side over here and the open side over here, or I might switch it around. I just kind of have it laid out that way right now. We'll decide when I go to put this together. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and put this all together. Then I'm going to show you some of the features because the long bed here has um, some storage in it, which is cool. And then the other part of the couch has this pull-out bed. It's pulled out right now. It, you can't really see it because it's just kind of a mess right now. Uh, but it's got a nice little pull-out and it makes a, a, a bed for it. So um, I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and put this thing together. I'm probably going to speed it up so you will just see it all done in just a second. So let's get right to it. Okay, in the package, you are going to get some washers and feet. I almost forgot about those. That's pretty much the only things that you need to assemble. And um, you're going to put some on the uh, armrests and on the bottom of the couches all the way around. So I'm going to do that next. But the, you just put the little washer in and screw it in just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and do those for the rest of them. Okay, I got everything put together on this couch, and um, if you follow the directions, again, I had to get the, the PDF uh, file for that. Um, you kind of put it together in, in a, a bits, like, like you have the end piece here, this piece goes into that, and then this piece goes into this, and then this piece goes into this. So if you just follow along, it works out pretty well and pretty easy. Um, very nice, uh, decent little couch. You've got your loungy part here that has a little secret compartment. So we can open this up and you've got a lot of storage. You can put a lot of uh, blankets and extra pillows and whatever else you need to put into there, you can 
for that, and that just folds up there. Now it does come with these nice big pillows as well because that little piece back here is not very comfortable, so you wanna make sure you put your pillows up there. And the pillows actually have uh, zippers, so you can take this out and wash it, which is really nice as well. Um, let's see, everything is pretty cool here. So again, a lounge and a couch. Now comes the pull-out bed part. So with that, what you're gonna do is they have little, little straps. Now you can tuck them in if you don't wanna see them, but you just pull this piece out we're gonna take this out till it stops. This comes up and flips right on top like that. So now you have a, a bed, basically. You can fit a couple people. Let me give you an idea. Um, let's see, I'm 5'8 ish, so it's almost big enough for me as 5'8. As um, so you might be able to hang off a little bit, put some pillows there. Um, you can sleep diagonally too if you want to, uh, but and then this part just goes out like that. So you can't really lay down in the bed wise this way. You can this way if you are short enough. Uh, this would be good for kids um, or if you have guests that you don't want to stay for very long, uh, they can kind of crash out on here. Um, the cushions are are okay. They're a little firm. Uh, it's not it's not the most comfortable couch I've ever sat on but it is a nice little convertible option in case you need it. So if you're looking for a futon couch pullout kind of thing like this, this one may be the right one for you.